we are here gathered here at Hotel Africana for three good days basically to discuss the issues that are still grappling uh, the population of Uganda uh, when it comes to water, sanitation and hygiene but also uh, diving into issues of integrated water resources management focusing basically on the nexus between water or sanitation and hygiene and climate change in Uganda. Ground water supplies uh, more than 75% uh, percent of drinking water sources uh, in Africa. And in Uganda, I think uh, more than 61% uh, of our drinking water sources are actually from groundwater. And basically that explains uh, the vital role that uh, groundwater uh, plays in food production, in employment, in livelihood improvement and wealth creation. The achievements of what we have done so far is that there is increased access to wash in the benefiting schools. And also, the capacity of AMDA to construct the model tank has improved. The innovation design has been approved by the Minister of Water and Environment. There is a big gap in uh, how our own heads of, head of state, our president, His Excellency, and his government are embracing water sanitation and hygiene. I also want to thank you all for your continued commitment. The fact that the room is still full from morning, since yesterday morning to today in the afternoon, it has proven that we are all here and interested in what um, our cause is, which is ensuring that water and sanitation is available to every Ugandan and our environment and these ecosystems are well preserved. So thank you so much. We all reserve a hand, hand clap for that. And we are glad that this time round we've been supported by our partners, the GIZ in Uganda and the CASI program but also the Austrian Development uh, Corporation, the Ministry of Water and Environment, Ministry of Health, but also uh, partners with Danish People's Aid to, who have enabled us to you know, bring all the civil society actors, uh, the members of USNET, including the CBOs, FBOs, the national NGOs, but also the international non-government organizations, including uh, the private sector.